Hi friends! Welcome back to this channel. It's been so long, I actually don't even remember how to vlog you guys. It's been a very long time, a lot has changed. If you guys have been following me on my second channel, which is my mukbang food channel, which I'll link down below, then you already know what's been going on since November. I have not posted on this channel in four months, you guys. And I had asked you guys multiple times what you guys wanna see more on this channel, and I would say nine out of 10 people say vlogs. So I figure I would come back with a vlog. It's been a very long time. I remember doing these all the time a few years ago, and it was super fun to bring you along with me on my college journey when I used to live at home with my mom. And we also vlogged a little bit when I first moved out with Carlos, and now we're in our what is this, our third place together, and we also have a fourth dog. Riley, come here, say hi. <laughs> we also have a fourth dog now. This is Riley, we just rescued him in November from Korea, and he's so cute. <laughs> I don't really know what the plan is for this channel. I just really wanna be back and I wanna be more personal with you guys and hang out with you guys more on this channel. Yeah, I'm excited to be back. And make sure you guys leave a comment down below. Let me know what more you wanna see, whether it's vlogs or makeup tutorials or whatever it may be. I don't even know what people do these days on YouTube. I mean, I just do mukbangs now. We've been living here for two months now. Most of our home is done. We've unpacked everything. Everything has a home in this place. Place, which is nice it finally feels like home we are finally going to conquer my studio the boxes are still in my studio we just haven't had time today you guys are gonna see us organize and tidy up my studio I don't think we're gonna finish today so this might be a multiple vlog kind of thing but I'm really excited for that um, so you guys will kind of see the studio room and see where I film my mukbangs and where I will be filming my tutorials come together yeah we'll see you in a little bit but first I'm going to make myself some lunch I know you wanted to order a burger yeah you guys I've been you're crooked <laughs> I know I'm crooked. Here. I'll fix it. I was gonna fix it on Final Cut Pro. Oh, I got you. Oh, you the best, honey. Uh... <laughs> um. So, oh, now I'm not. I feel like I'm still a little crooked. <sighs> okay. Hold on. Just a little bit. No, I think it was right. Oh, okay. Well, anywho. Um, I'm oh, gonna and then sorry. We're go gonna we're gonna show you Casper's ears because we didn't get to show you. And this is on my Kim Tai channel. Oh, this okay. is not for my mukbang well, channel. Okay, sorry. For uh, oh, here we go. if you guys don't know, and you know, like you guys strictly just follow this channel or whatever, um, Kim's been wanting to cut down Casper's ears because she feels like they're too long. He looks like Keanu Reeves, and it's awesome. No, anyways, like I think his ears look very, very beautiful right now. No, but like Kim Tai over here wants to like cut them down. Whatever. So you know what? Let me go ahead and show you right now. I'm gonna go ahead and show them. Uh, <laughs> I'm taking over your channel. I'm making a salad. Hey, oh, what's up, big guy? Look at him. He literally lays like Cooper. Cooper's right here. Say hi. You guys know Cooper. You guys have been around since Cooper was a baby. Oh, there's Mr. Rocky. Oh, oh man. We saw old man too. And then, okay, so now we're gonna show you Casper. He's just chilling on the couch. Hey, can I see your ears? Huh? Let me see your ears. See, look. Look, look at his ears. Look how beautiful they are. No, they're too pointy. Old man wants attention. Oh man, I can't give you attention right now. I'm focusing on your I brother. Think th I think that Casper's ears are too pointy. No, they're not. It, if, okay, you Casper. Know. No, no, no. Come on. If we just like... Look, okay. Look. Here, I'm trying to... Okay, no, look, no, no, look, 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 look. Look, look how ears, beautiful his no, ears look. the ears are too pointy. If we just take the ears and we just sniff the tip a little bit and make it rounder, he would look cuter. No, 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 no. I think so. Well, anyways, I hope... Oh, hold on. Oh, God, here we go. Hey, sit. Sit. Casper doesn't sit for you, honey. Casper, sit. Casper, yeah, he does. sit. Sit for mommy. Wow. Oh, he sat for me. Okay, look. I don't know if you can kind of get, like, if you can kind of tell. No, it's too pointy. But you guys let us know what you guys think. If you guys think we should leave his ears or... Can I show them my PJs? Sure. Oh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> hey, hey, oh. Oh, oh. Yeah, Brian so... Likes them. They're from H&M. They're the Disney collection. 
So yeah, um, go ahead and let us know if you Vote guys me. if you guys like the ears. Oh, okay, okay. If you guys like the ears or not, or if you guys think we should cut, cut them. Cut the ears. Oh my god. Okay. Here. <laughs> All right, you guys. Carlos is gonna order a burger because he's been craving it hardcore. I have. I don't know when's the last time I ate a burger. I have no idea. I'm making myself a salad. We have some leftover salad. This is a salad bag from Costco, you guys. We made this the other night with some chicken. Yes. Marinated grilled chicken. It was so good. This is the Earthbound Organic Caesar Salad Kit with yes. some dressing. dressing and then I'm going to put some shrimp in here. So that's what we're going to do. That Honestly, it's... <laughs> Baby, it's lunchtime right now, so I'm gonna make some lunch and then we're gonna conquer it. So you better order your burger, baby. Yeah. You guys, he is seriously so freaking cute. It's not like, I feel nauseous. Also, I just got these in the mail from Amazon. It said that it was not gonna come until the end of April, you guys, but oh my God, it came two days later. I was so surprised. It was like Christmas all over again. Anyways, I'm about to make my shrimp. I decided to put shrimp in my Caesar salad today. But yes, these cups came. If you guys don't know what they are, they're basically like doubled, what, what do you call it? Like double layered glasses. They have like, I'll show you when I pour something in. But I totally thought this was gonna be way bigger. This is kind of small. But I also got this one. How cute. And I realized I think I already have this one. But it's okay. The more the merrier. They're so cute. I wanna change out all the glasses in our house to be these. They're freaking adorable. I got them on Amazon. I'll link them down below for you guys if you're interested. They're really cute and classy. I mean, that might be better. You see how they're like double layered? Touch my body, everybody. Touch my body. De la bad, de la bad, de la bad. My old lovers fall into my covers where they sink one by one. Yeah, I watch them disappear to nothing. Disposable as chewing gum. I reminded Carlos that I bought bread the other day, so he's gonna make he's gonna make a turkey sandwich. Save money, baby. Save money. Would you like a salad? Sure. With your sandwich. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. Oh, regular ranch does not hit the spot like um. Caesar. Yeah. Caesar. Caesar. You can buy some Caesar. Wait, where do you even buy Caesar dressing? Don't they just sell it in the store? You know what? I don't know. I think your toast is done, babe. This is the glass, you guys. You see how it's like double layered? So cute. Look at Mr. Poopy. Mr. Pooper's turning two years old in three weeks, babe. We'll have to have a party. Do you guys remember when Carlos and I first moved into our first apartment? We got Cooper. And what, he, he came to us at three months and he was so small. I still have that vlog up. I watch it sometimes too. Oh, I know, I like re-watching it sometimes. He was so tiny. I would literally put him to sleep in the palm of my hands. I know, so I would, crazy. I would like rub his ears or like behind his ears. When I eat is usually when I uh, catch up on vlogs. Remy didn't post today. She's busy, she's trying to organize her house. I know, but Remy's been posting a vlog. Oh, he, she posted today, six hours ago. Oh, my goodness. Butters this so Dude, Remy's been posting every single day and this is my morning routine. I eat and I watch Remy's vlogs because she uploads really early. She uploads around like 10, I think. Soft, oh my God. So yes, good morning. It is currently Tuesday morning. Actually, it's only. Oh my gosh, you guys look. They used to fight each other all the time. And now look at them. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh. Look at these, they're all passed out. This is what they do all the time. They freaking love to sleep. They won't ever play with us. We have the most like non-active dogs ever. Why are our dogs so lazy? <laughs> Oh my god, they're so freaking cute. I die. I'm dying, babe. They used to fight. 
yeah they used to hate each other and now they're oh my god my heart we have to send it to amanda i realized that i have not edited my thumbnail for my mukbang that's going up in a few hours so i'm going to do that now if you guys wondering if you guys are wondering i edit all my thumbnails on my phone <laughs> um i used to edit them on this site called pick monkey but i haven't touched it in a very long time so i used i just edit all of my thumbnails on here i really want to teach myself how to use photoshop this year um i i know how to use lightroom and my lightroom i pay ten dollars a month and it comes with the photoshop program and i don't know how to use it so i want to teach myself and take some classes maybe oh it comes with photoshop yeah babe ten dollars comes with photoshop but I just use Lightroom for pictures. Okay, on to what we are doing today. This is the mess. So as you can see, this is like our little nook area. Originally, I wanted to put like a couch here and stuff, um, but then we had an extra room. So I was like, babe, you can make that your man cave. So I made this into like a cute little like, I don't know, photo sesh. On the uh, left here, we also have just like a desk with um, my computer. I forgot to mention this, but if you guys didn't know, I started a little photography side gig. Um, Carlos and I do that now, and it's we've only had it for like a month or so, and it's going really well. We love it so much. We're just still learning so much still, um, and I think we're gonna learn as we go. But this is kind of where I sit to edit. It's like a little bit of an office space. I would love later on in life to have like a studio room where I can also turn into an office. But yes, this is where I film. As you can tell, it is time for me to unbox. So originally, Carlos and I were going to move at the end of this year. So we were like, oh, we might as well leave those boxes there. But now we're thinking about staying another year. So our lives are all over the place, you guys. We do apologize, but I'm sure you guys know how it is and what it's like. Life just changes whenever it wants and you kind of have to alter, mm -hmm. you know, your plans and your routes. But now that I look at it, it's not that bad. It's really not. <laughs> it's just, we just gotta, the thing is, the room is the room, the room is what's bad. Like we just gotta unbox it. Yeah. And then All right, babe, let's get this party on the road. Is that the saying? Party on the road. <laughs> party on the road. Huh? Let's get this party on the road. Yeah. Is that the saying? No. I've never heard of that in my life. Or is it, the, let's get this party rolling? Let's get the show on the road. Ah, oh, let's get this show on the road. <laughs> I think that's how you, I don't know. We're not good with sayings, we butcher everything. No. There are deal breakers where I come from. My family don't suffer, fools glad they know. Do we kiss and lie in bed to feel awkward silences? Do we feel emptiness afterwards? You guys, I got these containers from the container store and I'm freaking obsessed with them. If you guys have more um, high-end, like expensive shoes and you wanna keep them protected, these were actually the most affordable thing I could find. They have like bougier ones, but I mean, it's just to cover your shoes. So I was like, why, you know, I don't need to go that in. But you put your, oh my God, I'm like advertising it to be good and it like falls apart. Oh, it just, it, it puts back together. But you put your shoes in here. So say like, I really wanted like these. I can put them like sideways. Probably these are higher, but um, I'll show you guys when I do like the closet section organization. Comment down below if you guys wanna see that. And then you just close it and it keeps your shoes from getting dusty and all that, you know? I want something deeper If I'm a find a keeper Saying I'm some genius But I'm smart enough to know I'm worth fighting for Yeah, I want something deeper If I find it, I'ma keep them Not saying I'm some genius Okay, you guys, the middle section actually fits perfectly. If you guys are wondering, I got this shelf section, self shelf, uh, sectional shelf thing. 
I don't know what to call this thing. I got this years ago when I used to live back home at my mom's. You guys remember it was between my closet and my bathroom. I got it at Ikea. I will link it down below because I get so many freaking questions about it. I personally love the white, but every time I see the black, I literally get a little bit excited, you guys. It is so sleek and beautiful. So you can get them the full size. I believe the full size is six feet tall. I also have another one on this side where I have my Buddha statues so Carlos and I can pray at night and then we also have all of my bags over there and then on this side I think I'm going to put all of my makeup containers which the movers wrapped up and everything and so I need to unwrap that and then I think in another video we'll declutter everything but in the middle I had no idea that Ikea also sold half sizes so all of these are in the same family these are just taller and then if you can't commit to the tall ones you can get a mini one which is basically one two three shelves it looks like this and honestly it fits beautifully in between two big ones but I'm not gonna lie had I known that I was gonna do this one day I would have gotten the whole entire piece because you know it also comes together babe yeah, it, it all comes together and it all connects. So I will link every single thing down below for you guys because I think that would be really, really um, just convenient for you guys to click on the link and see what you need. Oh, Carlos got some uh, clementines for Buddha. Oh, we need some new flowers for Buddha too, babe. Yeah, I just saw them. Yeah, oh, we, have to, we haven't been able to go to the store, so the flowers died. I'm kind of liking this. Um, I was looking for a place for this plant, you guys, and I could not find one in this house. I tried putting it in our bathroom, and it just didn't go well. I was going to put it, like, on the side behind my computer, on the desk, on the nook, but I don't know. It's just so pretty that I wanted everybody to see it. <laughs> um, I got this plant with Michelle when we went to Target um, a few months ago, a very long time ago, actually. She has one in her room as well. We actually bought it together. We gave names for it, but I don't remember the names. But I think for now, I like it right there. So we are almost finished with the camera stuff. I just have to categorize. I got these little, um, here, where did I put the other one? Um, where, oh, there they are. I got these little, hopefully you guys can see. I got these little clear see-through uh, drawer thingies. And I thought they were going to be way bigger. Um, I'm just not somebody who looks at the dimensions i think i know but i never know <laughs> so that's totally my fault but i thought they were going to be a little bit bigger but they turn out to be kind of small but for some reason it works i'm okay with that i want to use these for like um well these right down here are going to be camera chargers extra batteries wires things like that like little things that you want to get organized but i think these would be so cute to put makeup in as well i have one extra they come in a pack of two, so I got four total, and they're so cute. The drawer completely pulls out, but you can also insert it in here. I think it's freaking adorable. It's so mini. I think this would be really cute on like um, a bathroom top too. If you want to put like skincare or like makeup products, I will go ahead and link this down below for you guys as well because I think it is so cute, and I believe two Two of them for 20 bucks, so each one was $10. Um, it's, I mean, if you guys have experience buying acrylic, I always say this, I always say this wrong, acrylic, acrylic. <laughs> I always say the freaking word wrong, I'm so sorry. Um, they tend to be a little bit pricier, but what I love about them is that you can see exactly what's inside because I have this thing where if I don't see it, I won't use it. So I love that I'm able to see everything inside so I remember that I have it. My family don't suffer, fools glad they know. Do we kiss and lie in bed to feel awkward silences? Do we feel empty? 
If you are looking for a great carry-on travel bag, I freaking love this. I bought this right before Hawaii and it is absolutely amazing. It's very spacious, super cute, and on the back, what I love is it has this slit. Honestly, guys, I don't know why I never thought of this before. Isn't this so freaking smart? That way you don't have to worry about your bag falling off when you're rolling through the airport. You can also use it as a gym bag as well. They have different sizes, I believe. I got a medium. I believe I got a medium because the small was too small and then the large was like a huge duffel bag. So I got a medium and I love this color as well. We'll probably leave the closet for another day, you guys, but remember the containers I showed you earlier in this video? Well, I put them up. I got four. Yeah, four on the top and four on the bottom. But it basically looks like that. And whenever you want to wear it, you just open it up and then the shoes are inside. It keeps it from getting dirty, getting dusty. But I'm going to show you Carlos's closet because he has these two and he finished his like weeks ago. So you'll get a better idea. This is his closet. And these are what it looks like. So basically, shoes that you really want to protect and you cherish and you don't want them to get dusty or dirty, you put them in here. He has a lot. He, I think, I think Carlos has 12 boxes up here. So it really depends on your closet, but I think they're a great investment. You can, you can buy, I think, a pack of four or six, I believe. I'll have it linked down below. Hopefully they still have it, but they're so easy, you guys. You just kind of flop them open. But there's a bunch of these online. I just find that the container store is the most trustworthy. The other brands were kind of like Facebook advertisements and I was kind of scared that it was a scam. So these are amazing. I love them. Alrighty guys, this is as far as we got today, which is pretty good. So unfortunately, I cannot film in my studio until it's done. So I'm gonna split this up into two more days. So today is Thursday. I should be done with this room, honestly. If I really work hard, I should be done by Saturday night. Um, so I think this will be tomorrow, this will be Saturday, and then we will be good to go for Sunday. But this is what it looks like so far. We have all of the makeup. Like I said, I wanna declutter a lot of that. We have all the camera, all of the bags. Closet still needs a lot of help, and then I have to go through these boxes, which I'm not gonna lie, makes me very nervous because I'm scared that I'm just gonna have a lot of shit that I don't need, but it's okay, we'll donate them. It's just we cannot leave the house right now, so we'll probably just have to store them in the garage for the time being. Yeah. Um, I have no idea, I mean, it says fragile on it, so I have no idea, and Michelle's not gonna remember what we packed either. You don't remember, I don't remember, so honestly, I it's... Know some stuff is from like the table that we had in the room. Oh. From that table? Yeah. I think a lot of, I mean, every single box, I feel like it's just gonna be a surprise. But, um, before I take a shower and have dinner, I think I'm gonna clear up outside of the room just so we don't feel so frustrated when we wake up tomorrow and tonight when the dogs come up to go to sleep and stuff. So we have like a lot of things here. We ha I wanna clear all of this, like I wanna clear this, like now this is my next task. This shouldn't take too long to be honest. It's, the sun is setting so it's kind of super blue toned. Oh, by the way, um, a lot of you guys asked where I got this mirror. This is the Prim Rose Gleaming Mirror from Anthropology, and this is the biggest size they have. I believe this is uh, seven feet. I have the, um, if you're just referencing, this is the five. This is the five feet. If you guys remember, I used to have this on top of my vanity table at my old place. You can put this above the fireplace. You can, I've seen people put it like anywhere. It, it looks absolutely amazing. You can also paint it as well. It comes in this color black, which we have out here. I love, I love the big one. This was actually one of my goals. Um, I've always wanted it, so I saved up enough money to get it. And when we moved here and I saw this area upstairs, I was like, oh my God, it's finally coming true. So this is basically everything. I have to move my water bottle and my phone, but I love this little um, 
drawer cabinet thing. I think it's so pretty. Hello. I'm going to hop in the shower now. Um, this is our bathroom, by the way. I'm probably going to do this in a video because I want to organize these drawers. I got these little compartments at Target, and oh, they were so inexpensive, you guys. I'll try to find it online and link it for you guys. You know what I love? They're so flexible, extremely flexible, and easy to clean super easy to clean and they came in all of these sizes i got like a bunch of them this is our little or my little skincare section i'll probably go through these in like a bathroom video but for now we are going to shower because i feel so gross and i'll see you guys for dinner <laughs> i just finished the shower i just got out of the shower washed my hair feels so good to shower you guys after uh cleaning for how long Four or five hours. I'm gonna go ahead and do my skincare. I've been trying out some new products. This is the Drunk Elephant B Hydra Intensive Hydration Serum. And then these two products I'm very familiar with. I actually got the smaller version of this because the big version is 80 bucks, you guys. This is the Drunk Elephant TLC Sukari Baby Facial Facial something something. This thingy. It like burns and tingles a little bit which I've been watching TikTok and a lot of people are saying that a dupe to this is the Ordinary brand. It's like $7 and it makes your face like super red. And then the Luxury Facial Oil from Drunk Elephant is absolutely amazing. I literally put this all over my face before I go to bed, but for right now, I'm not going to do that. But oh my God, you guys, if you have dry skin, this is amazing. It's so expensive, but... I also got a bunch of travel sizes when I had rewards with Sephora, which I heard so Sephora now is doing cash back. Is that true? I don't know. So I'll let you guys know. But I think I'm going to go in with this. I also got a uh, travel size of the Drunk Elephant Polypeptide Cream. Um, I don't know. I think I might. I'm going to use this today, actually. This I bought full size because the reviews were like amazing. I have been so dry lately. I need as much hydration as possible, you guys. Like to the point where I had like flakes on the corner of my uh, nose. Ooh, you know what? I also need to uh, shave and groom my eyebrows. Been letting my eyebrow hair grow. The last time I touched my eyebrows was January 20th. So like two months ago. I usually get my eyebrows waxed now at the nail salon. Uh, this lady that works at the nail salon also waxes his eyebrows and she's been doing a pretty good job Her name is Kelly at Biletone in Huntington Beach and she also she always like cleans my brows, but um With everything that's been going on. I haven't gone to her also been obsessed with this I got it in a little sample size travel size thing as well uh, This is the is it Laneige or Laneige? Uh, lip Sleeping mask. You guys know how I love this in the pink color? Well, this is the vanilla, and I love it even more. I think I might buy a, um, a full size. I always have chapped lips. I'm so sorry. I know it bothers a lot of you guys. I'm trying my best here. We have Old Man. Old Man's the best. Old Man is the best. He's so good. This is Old Man, aka Rocky. Um, oh, I wanted to show you guys. Um, oh, you know what? I'll, here, Mom is trying to show your light. Oh, if you guys have a dog and you walk your dogs at night, like a long walk before bed like we do, um, get this on Amazon. I will link it down below. It's this huge like light. Do you guys see how? Oh my gosh, it is so bright at night. Okay, thank you, Papa. Thank you. Last snack of the night, because you had a good dinner. Yes, good dinner, everybody. You can only, no, you can only get a snack if you sit. You know the rule. I think old man was the best today, yeah? Here you go, old man. Thank you, Rocky. And then who was second best today? Who was most well behaved? Was it Mr. Cooper? Thank you, Koopy. Oh, Riley. I think Riley, you guys both are the best, but mommy's gonna give Riley first. Riley, will you do Paul for mama? And Paul? <gasps> Thank you very much. And then Caspi, Caspi. And what are we working on, Caspi? That you don't get aggressive when you bite this, okay? Thank you. For all the pet parents out there, we actually give our dogs this treat that has been super amazing, you guys. I will link it down below. I buy it off Amazon, and it is not raw hide. Why? 
I cannot speak today. Um, it's a healthier version. Um, it is doesn't have all the bad stuff in it and it comes in a pack of, oh my God, it comes in a really big pack. We have four dogs, so it just, it goes, like I've literally bought it two weeks ago and we're gone. Um, it goes by really fast for us because we do have four dogs, but really good option. Our vet recommended it. And then also Bunny's Buddies uh, owner, Amanda, also recommends it to, um, to her dogs as well. And then we also have these really healthy uh, fish sticks. Really good for their skin and coat. Carlos did all the dishes. Oh, well, he just fed the dogs. Oh, wait, these are actually clean. He just fed the dogs, so those, I think, are... They look clean. Are they clean, Koopy? Do you know? <laughs> but he did the dishes so I think I'm gonna wipe down the stove and like the countertops and everything just you know wipe everything down all right friends I'm going to end the vlog right here I hope you guys love this vlog I hope you guys will leave a comment down below please give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe if you guys haven't already I'm gonna eat dinner I'm gonna watch some TV I'm gonna end this video I will see you guys back here if not tomorrow, the day after. We will see when I will see you guys next. But definitely leave a comment down below and let me know what more you guys want to see on this channel. I'm so excited to be back. I love you so much and I will see you guys then. Bye my loves.